the last thing you learned in a classroom? Well, I'm taking a media class, talking about all kinds of media problems and you know, issues. And why do you continue to take classes? Well, because I think if you're smart, you try not to ever stop learning about something, whatever your interests are. And I think it keeps you more alert and more interested and interesting. And I just, it's a social kind of thing as well as intellectual. So I think it's, it's beneficial for young and old, and I'm old. <laughs> we are the teacher of volunteers. Uh, we teach Chinese in high school and middle schools. So I'm teaching in St. Mary's in Medford. Uh, she's teaching in, uh, actually in high school. I'm teaching in Scenic Middle School and Hanby Middle School in Simmer Point. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> enjoy life here. And our students, yeah. And how would you say in Chinese, my question, what, do, what was the last thing you learned in a classroom? Mm. Speaking of the most, the thing I learned from the classroom here is I learned how to be more happy, you know, with my students and everything. I'm so proud of them. They can speak a lot of Chinese now. And I experienced the happiness to be a teacher and sharing that knowledge with other people. Okay, what I learned from classroom, uh, is really, uh, as a Chinese teacher, uh, I got a Chinese two class and um, I just figured out uh, actually now the kids could speak much more Chinese than I imagine and they can understand more. So before I came uh, uh, from our training, uh, we've been taught to be very patient to the students. And uh, when I got here, I, I just find out, I find out uh, patient is not enough. Yeah, on one hand, you need to be patient, but on the other hand, you need to push them a little bit more. <laughs> just patience is not enough. The most important thing I want to say is to find the balance. Uh, not just for teaching, even your, in your life, how to balance uh, with your parents, uh, with your study, or with your friends. Everything is uh, so important with the balance. The thing you learned in a classroom? Well, I was lucky, lucky enough to participate in the Ford Family Foundation's effective organizational leadership that's offered to nonprofit workers in Jackson and Josephine County. I work for Family Solutions, which provides mental health treatment for children and their families in both Jackson and Josephine County as a development director. And I learned so much in this two-day workshop. I think that it's important for people in development particularly to remember their connection to the mission, the heart connection to the mission, and then share that story with others in the community so they understand why the work we do is so important.